Yo, what is going on everybody? It is Wes from Albino Raven and today we're hunting Leighton Lakes. As you can tell by the video, thumbnail, and the title, I found me a pretty old black thing. That's right, I found me a melanistic duck and it is beautiful, beautiful. I love melanistic animals. They are just beyond hot, whatever you want to say. And if you want to see more of those, Make sure you hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos, check out the channel, hit that little notification thing to let them know, let you know whenever my videos go live. Speaking of which, I'm going to try to upload weekly, I've got a little bit more time, which is kind of weird, I actually have a little bit more time now because I have a kid because i got to watch him so I can play <laughs> while I'm you know, taking care of him, but anyways. So yes, I will be uploading weekly, hopefully. Plan is every Friday, we'll see. I might decide to change that and go to a different schedule, but hey, it is what it is. So, here we are at the lake. I do believe this is the bottom left lake, and that is a great spot for elk and blacktail deer. I don't really ever see whitetail deer there so much, but I do see a lot of elk and blacktail deer. So if you're looking for a diamond elk or a diamond blacktail deer, that is one of the lakes I would start at. Any of the lakes where there's an outpost on it, uh, especially on the west side of the map, those are muy bueno for big old trophy animals. As you can see here, I'm trying to shoot the duck with the 22, and my aim just absolutely sucks. <laughs> so, you know, it is what it is. Here I go trying to shoot out of the air. And uh, yeah, you'll see that I don't know even remotely what I'm doing at all. Somehow I hit that thing and I don't even like, like what was that? Like what the heck was that? <laughs> I don't even understand. But yes, it's at Renacci. It is at the bottom left of the, uh, of the map and yeah. So you guys might have noticed that I was using a dog. I know I said before that the dogs were really a waste of money. Well, I was wrong. And so were other people like, you know, I have noticed that I have actually used my dog quite a bit whenever I shoot an animal. 326, wow. I forgot what he scored, sorry. So I've used the dog quite a bit, especially after I shoot an animal and I'm like, where the boop did he go, right? Cause I'm like, I don't know where he went. I don't know where he's supposed to be at. I can't find it. Dude, little Sally, which is the dog's name that I named her from Cars, you know, the little bitty Jaguar thing that, yeah, anyways, dude. That has helped me tremendously. He helps me find stuff whenever I lose it all the time. And this is probably the clip that you guys have been waiting on. So you might notice I used a different variation of the 22 here. I do like this variation better. So there's two variations of the 22. There's also two variations of the 300. Well, I found that I like the Black Barrel 300 variation better. I can't remember what it's called. And I like the Olive Tan whatever. Um, uh, stock barrel holder thing. I can't really call it. Not the stock. But anyways, I like that look better than the other one. So that's why I changed up the guns. I like the I like the look of it. I don't know. I'm weird. Anyways, so I found actually, oddly enough, I found the melanistic female in that flock herd, whatever. And I found two diamond potential um, mallards in there as well. So if you're curious where this is, I don't remember if I end up showing it or not, but it is basically, if you're looking at the river where it wise out, if you take the river to the almost the top on the right side of the Y, that is where like there's lakes and there's like little river systems or whatever. That is where I'm at right now. That is what this is. And it is, I mean, this is what you find. Obviously you're not gonna find it every time because I won't. So, but you know, still, I mean, I've. <laughs> Two diamond potential mallards and a melanistic in the same flock herd thing, you know, cattle buddy system thing, whatever it is, battle buddy, I don't know. Anyways, look at this freaking field goal post for antlers, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. Like I saw him, I was like, oh yeah, I'm taking him out. Especially after I got trolled in a video and you'll see if you stay around and watch my channel videos, I was hunting, um, this lake, obviously, uh, actually, I think it was this lake, and I ended up um, 
shooting a level five. No, I don't think it was this life. Anyways, I shot a level five Roosevelt elk, and I was flipping out, man. Because I was, we have a competition in my Discord, which BT Dubs, if you want the Discord link, comment down below in the comment section and let me know. You want the link? I'll send it to you. Besides that, though. So yeah, so I was in that. I was like, dude, I got this freaking thing in the bag, and it freaking trolled me. And then I had another level five uh, Rocky Mountain elk. That thing trolled me too. So I, needless to say, my luck with elk is pretty much non-existent. I've never gotten a diamond, and I've only been trolled the few times I got one. So yeah. Speaking of which, uh, in the comments section, guys, let me know what is your favorite animal to hunt in. Hunter Call of the Wild, Leighton Lakes, and also let me know what is or how much what is your most played map and how much are you playing these days? Like, are you playing Savannah the most and you play like two days a week or what is it? I'm just curious to see what you know what you guys' interest level is, what kind of videos you want to see, and also let me know what kind of videos do you guys want to see. I am taking this to a um a basically a what you call it like a I, I am putting real life videos on here like it's gonna be kind of like a gaming real life channel so you know um, fishing videos will be hunting videos just not yet obviously because it's not hunting season and I ain't trying to get ticketed so you know let me know what kind of stuff you guys want to see catch clean cooks you know all that kind of stuff because that is what I love that is a ton of fun to me that's what I want to do but I want to make sure that you guys are getting the content that you want to get also so let's just kind of work together and see what we can come up with so I mentioned a competition in the Discord, right? So this actually was for the competition in the Discord, but this week uh, a guy told me, he said, hey, let's just hunt certain maps and you can try to get a moose off of that certain map. So I I was, I was designated Layton, or I picked Layton, I don't remember how it worked. Anyways, I found um, so many max weight moose. Like, well, let me phrase that. So many max weight estimate meets. Like, so many. But yet, none of them made diamond. I hate to spoil it for you, but you know what? <laughs> it's just, none of them made diamond, man. I couldn't find one if it meant my life depended on it. I was just getting straight smacked out in these streets. You know what I mean? So, it is what it is. No big deal. But, yeah. It was not a fun trip. But it was a lot of, let me rephrase that, it was a fun trip. It wasn't like it was miserable hunting moose, but it was just like, man, you know. And as here, I'm about to give this freaking female moose a Texas heart shot because uh, it was a freaking butt. <laughs> but yeah, man, like it was, it was bad. Like I couldn't find nothing. But hey, that's part of it, right? That's part of the hunt. That's part of the fun. You go out, you look for it, you see what you can get. So it is what it is. Also, guys, I am going to be uploading weekly, um, or I'm going to try to. I have a little bit more time now, which is kind of weird because usually whenever you have a newborn, you have less time. Well, I do have less time, but I have my time is able to be is more able to be spent doing this kind of stuff because whenever I'm watching him, I basically gotta just sit there with him because he can't do anything. He's not he's gonna you know ask me for the keys or anything. So. I'll uh, make videos and stuff, so I do have more time to do that, but I am going to be getting back to the more real-life videos, like I said. But in that meantime, um, why don't you guys uh, let me know, I don't know, like what kind of animals you want to see me hunt for next. What? Uh, why don't you guys join the Discord? Why don't you get you know involved? Because it's a lot of fun. We have a lot of good guys, especially if you're not the best at this game, like me. Um, you know, we have guys in there that are able to teach you what you need to know, how you need to know it, when you need to know it, why you need to know it. So, you know, just some cool stuff like that. You'll get a lot of awesome, good help. There's, this community is awesome. It really, really is. So, like I said, just comment down below. Hey, give me the Discord link, homie, and I'll do it. Or, you know, hey, loser, Discord link, or whatever you want to say. Basically, include the word Discord, <laughs> and I got you. So... It is what it is. Another thing I didn't know, and you guys might not know, I actually learned this from watching other people play, is that whenever you shoot an animal in the neck and it actually hits a neck bone, 
then now not the skull you cannot hit the skull but if you hit the neck bones any of the lower or upper neck bones you get vital blood so you get a vital hit so it counts as your vital check it doesn't destroy the trophy organ so yeah, as you see that's what i just did right here and it worked out freaking phenomenally phenomenally and yeah so i don't understand how this moose scored gold that is one of the ugliest racks i've ever seen it looks like he's got a freaking ding dong sticking out of his freaking left antler like that brow tine was just terrible i'm just saying like I, it is what it is right but well uh, no so i know they have true racks so i, I don't know I know they don't all look good or whatever, but I get it, but mm. man, oh man, sheesh, <laughs> you gotta wonder about it sometimes, you know, like, did they really thought that that would be a good idea to do that, like, to put that in there, mm. I don't know, hey, whatever, right, I guess that's why I don't make the video, or I don't make the game, see, now that rack, that looks normal, that looks okay, that looks good, you know, I wish I had the little brown tine or whatever that like stuck out and was a lot more because that would have made him a diamond but of course he just didn't grow it and if this game led it to where you could like let the animals grow into diamonds and stuff that'll be pretty freaking cool but i've also heard that a lot of people glitch it so you know that's kind of one of the bummer things there so it is what it is and i did say i thought earlier in this video that all the animals that i shot were max weight animals but it does not look like the this guy was a max weight estimate. I do remember I popped him pretty good. I kept going for the heart. Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Oh, I got him there. But I somehow, I don't know what I hit, a freaking tree, a light pole. I don't know what it was, but somehow I missed that. So that was kind of annoying. But it is what it is. So there we are picking up the guy. I do end up going, I thought I ended up going back to the trophy lodge, but I guess not. But anyways, I will show you guys that video next time i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you guys enjoy this kind of content make sure you hit that subscribe button again guys it helps me out it lets me know that you guys do want to see my content and we'll keep it rolling from there i hope you guys have an awesome day remember keep fishing keep hunting keep praying it's very important i hope you guys enjoy i hope you guys have an awesome day i'll catch you guys on the next one peace out carol scouts